Hello everyone and welcome to Bad Universe with me, Elita de Silva, and this infinity band. So for today's upper body strength or strengthening training with a band, we're gonna use um, the yellow one. If you feel that you're strong enough to pull it, so this will be a little bit higher intensity, then grab the green one, as usually the green one is a little bit thicker than the yellow one. So what we want to do, what we want to do now is to place our elbows just right next to our pelvis bones, just like here, right above at the corner. We want to glue the upper part of our arms along the body and never really open them up. And here we have a 90 degree angle in the elbows. Um, while the infinity band is wrapped around the wrists. And all we want to do is to just pull the band out. We have about eight, maximum 12 of these while the spine is straight, right? We're shining from within, pushing the clavicular bones up high, keeping the neck long and the shoulders low down. Whenever we're done with the slow ones, we're gonna go for the quick pulses. Just Make sure you keep your elbows down, close, near by your body without doing this stuff, right? We really want to go deep and work with purpose right here. Keep the breath going on, keep your energy floating up, your shoulders falling down. Last four, three, two, one, release. Good. Now we're going to place the elastic up. So this is going to feel quite nice for the shoulders. So arms are up, elastic is up. Tuck. Just like this, we're going to start pulling the band with slightly bended elbows outwards, right? I can between 8 to 12 of these pulls um, while the upper body still stays straight and you're keeping the breath going on. Concentrate on to the shoulders or they would like to go up. You have to really go in a pose and push them back down. Whenever you're done with the 8 to 12, you go and just simply speed up. Last one, release, there you go. Hearing yourself breathe is gonna really keep you aware of what's going on with your body, right? Breathing is key for training. Whatever you do, breathing pattern is gonna lead you further in um, your resistance to fatigue and further up to reaching whatever result you are chasing right so key factor for training is breathing now as we have already rested our shoulders for a couple of seconds we're going to go back down we're going to continue with the first one again go ahead and pull the elastic this time go a little bit further out for 8 to 12 of these still keeping the elbows nearby the body the shoulders low down the next long like swans whenever you're down with the slow ones go ahead and pull out 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 good i'm sure you feel it right here it's quite unpleasant burning that's happening especially by the last two to uh, one breath in and out, but this is what we're going for, right? Now we're gonna place again our arms up, the shoulders are remaining down. Now we're gonna work, while the band is still pulled out, we're gonna work to bring it down and up um, with the elbows pointing sideways. So keep them out, 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 and then pull and or push up while keeping the elbows still outward so you don't want to really bend them to the front and then wonder what's happening no keep them down keep them sideways and continue this again between 8 to 12 it's a little bit challenging because we have to pull the elastic outwards all the time the shoulders down all the time and also still keep the spine straight all the time so it's a lot of coordination here it's one simple movement but it takes a little bit more concentration whenever you're done with your 8 to 12 repetitions continuing the work with the breath you're going to release the band you're going to shake off your shoulders a little bit and you are simply going to go um, and have 
the starting position with the arms nearby the body we're gonna pull the elastic and keep it there what you're going to do is you're going to simply come up your elbows as you see are still bended and you're gonna come back down you're gonna come up so I'm remaining in one straight line from the fingers up to the shoulder while I'm pulling the elastic and while I'm moving my arms up and down there you go so your abdominals are active your chest is active so you're breathing fully aware and you have again between 8 to 12 repetitions just like this trying to remain in the bended elbow position ideally we want to keep the 90 degree and come up just like this and come back down right while you're still pulling the band while you're still breathing while you're still keeping the shoulders on it's a lot of coordination again but you can do it just concentrate and be aware of what's happening whenever you're done with your l to 12 repetitions you're going to release the band you're going to shake out your arms you're going to give a little rotations to your shoulders and you're going to go and repeat the whole sequence if you have the strength depending on your fitness level one to two more times right with enough of break in between for this part of your body to be able to recover right so give a nice break in between the sets um you're gonna definitely benefit from this for your everyday posture for the control of your shoulder girdle and respectively for the control of your chest and breathing patterns right so good luck with this one